XRP, Quant Network, Electronium, and Avalanche are having a meetup on November 10th. Now, why is this important? Because a representative from the Bank of England, yes, the Bank of England, is going to be there. Now, Avalanche, AVAX, and Electronium is a hidden gem. Now, we all know about XRP and Quant, but I want you to notice something. They are all part of this Digital Pound Foundation that is very important right now because the United Kingdom is taking blockchain, is taking CBDC efforts very seriously. And I will leave a link to this 90 page document below. It is one of the biggest studies in the United Kingdom ever about blockchain. Like look at all of these organizations. It is so much to even talk about in this video, but I will leave a link to it down below. And what is important right now is this meetup on November 10th, literally right here, the Digital Pound Foundation tweeted this and they said William Lovell, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, of the Bank of England, literally works for the Bank of England will be joining this webinar on November 10th. And this is the first time ever that we get to see some insight on this digital pound foundation between XRP, Accenture, Quant, and Electronium because we have heard so much about this on social media, on Twitter, on YouTube, on TikTok, but we wanna see more. We wanna see like what are their goals, but this is a little tiny sneak peek about what's to come. So if you're excited, literally, if you own any of these amazing crypto Cryptocurrencies, AVAX, ETN, XRP, or QNT, QNT, destroy the like button down below and make sure you join us because we do giveaways on a weekly basis. I'm going to give back to all of you because truly without you, this could not be possible at all. So you all make this possible for me. So I'll give back to you. Now, Avalanche, AVAX, I want to speak about the price of them for just a second because what's interesting is that they're all part of this digital pound foundation, but they've all had crazy different years. Like look at AVAX, for example, it went from three dollars from january 1st okay these will all be from january 1st to today so we're going to take a look at avax etn xrp and quant they all have way different charts now that is a lesson now what do i mean by that because a lot of people tell me should i trade should i invest me personally, I invest with my hard earned money. I invest. Why? Because the biggest mistakes I've ever made and the biggest mistakes the people I know have ever made have been with trading. When you try to trade good investments, you will buy at the top and sell at the bottom, basically. So you will make mistakes. You will not be profitable because 90 plus percent of traders lose money. They literally go to zero over time if they keep trying to trade. Now, what do I mean by that? Because AVAX started the year at $3. It went up within a month or two, all the way up to over $50. Yes, and then it lost about 80% of its value, went down to $10, and it went back up now. It's back up at $76, so it's had a crazy year. Imagine buying at $50 and then selling down here at $10 because you're trying to trade it, okay? So whenever people come to me and try to ask me, should I buy, when should I sell, when should I buy, when should I sell, I tell them, hey, you should have a investor's mentality. Now, Electronium has had a completely different year as well. It did not break its previous all-time high this year, Avalanche did, Electronium didn't, XRP still has not broken its all-time high from this year, and Quant has destroyed its all-time high, but now it seems like it's going to go down. And just a couple days ago, I told you how I believe Quant, yes, will come down to less than $200, but expect XRP to pump in the next couple of weeks when quant goes down. So I'm, what I'm trying to say is all of these might have different cycles. They might go up and down at different times. So ask yourself, are you an investor or a trader? That is something you must ask yourself. Now, XRP, we all know, is going to break his previous all-time high of $3.5 and much more this bull run. So we have not yet gotten to the end of the bull run whatsoever. Euphoria has not kicked in whatsoever. Now, Quant also, I just said, it will go down below 200, but it will go back up and it will break his all-time high and much more this bull run still. Now, electric 
Tronium as well. If you take a look at its all-time chart, it has about a, another 20x to go. Yes, 20x to reach its previous all-time high. And Electronium is tiny. It's at $350 million only. But Avalanche is at $55 billion. Avalanche is valued way more than Electronium, but they are all part of this Digital Pound Foundation. They are all working together on this elite group. So what I'm trying to tell you also is that there is opportunity in here. In Electronium, for example, that has not yet broken its all-time high. And XRP, there's a lot of opportunity in XRP as well. Now Quant, me personally, I think it can go down a little bit, so you might want to wait. But Avalanche also, I think it can come back down. Yes, Avalanche, this right here, I believe it can come back down, but you never know. It might break $100. Um, it's at an all-time high right now, so you're taking a big risk. So these are all great investments working on the same vision of achieving a digital pound, a CBDC in the United Kingdom, but they all have different charts. So with my top holdings, like today, we just, I covered literally my number one cryptocurrency and I do not trade it. I invest. That is what I do because it's worked. And statistically, if you try to trade this, this really volatile chart, you will lose. You will lose, statistically speaking. Now, investing is the best strategy. And if you also agree, if you think that investing is a way to go, show your support down below. And if this is your first time on my channel, or if you have not yet already, subscribe. So just remember that November 10th is going to be a special day and the Bank of England has an interest in this digital pound foundation. So whatever happens with the price of AVAX, of Electronium, of XRP, of Quant, that does not matter because fundamentally, again, they are great investments, investments. I do not try to trade it, but in the next couple of days, also do not be surprised if the market gets scared again. Why? Because a $1.2 trillion infrastructure bill was passed by the United States Congress and it was given to President Joe Biden and he has 10 days to sign off on this bill that will tax crypto. Any transaction of $10,000 right here must be reported by and within 15 days. Otherwise, you will be facing felony charges. This is literally the bill. Any transaction, any withdrawal of $10,000 or more of crypto will have to be reported to the United States government or you will get possibly go to jail. So they want to tax your crypto and why is that important? How will that affect everything? And what am I doing with my own wealth and my portfolio? I spoke all about that in this video right here, XRP and HBAR. I lost all of my crypto because I have a feeling if the United States government tries to tax cryptocurrency, people will start losing their crypto out of nowhere. Like I have no idea where it went or I have this much and they truly have that much. I'm not saying that's what I'm going to do. I might just leave the country and just do it legally. You know, there are so many different options, but the United States government should embrace crypto, should create an environment where crypto can thrive and not hinder it. We cannot hinder the growth of crypto because as we spoke, XRP is the future, Quant is the future, Electronium is the future, AVAX, Avalanche is the future with the United Kingdom and here in the United States. Yes, the Federal Reserve in the past has worked with XRP. We have a lot of connections between Quant and the Federal Reserve. So my advice to the United States government and to Mr. President to Joe Biden is to think about embracing crypto. Why not? Because just like you do not want to tax stocks that much, you do not want to tax cryptocurrency that much because crypto has much more potential. That is what I'm trying to say. Crypto has much more potential than stocks. So if you're pushing crypto away, you're pushing innovation away, you're pushing the future away from America, and it's going to be around whether you like it or not because crypto is everywhere. It's all around the world. It's decentralized 100%. So if something happens to a country, 
crypto will still be there. Nothing will happen to crypto. So my advice to the United States government is to embrace and help us crypto investors to make it easier on us. And don't get me started with the unrealized gain stuff. Anyways, watch this video right here. I literally spoke about it for 13 minutes, all about what I will do if this gets out of control. So but right now, November 10th, in a couple of days, Accenture is also part of this. Accenture, Accenture is very interesting. Do your homework with Accenture and CBDCs around the world. Accenture is something to take very seriously. And also, the fact that they're part of this Digital Pound Foundation is very impressive. So AVAX, Electronium, XRP, Quant, and all these other cryptocurrencies that we speak about on this channel, we that's why we get hyped every single day. And the Bank of England, again, is taking this very seriously. And this is my third time saying this in this video because this is important. A special guest from the Bank of England the head of future technology literally the head of future technology is going to be in this webinar and that is what you're invested in you're invested in solid great projects and again consider the difference between investing and trading trading is not what i do and is not what i suggest you to do but that is what I, that's what i that's me. That's me personally. Do you agree? Do you not? Let me know down below. And that's it. Um, I need to go do some other stuff and yeah, edit these videos, upload them. I love you all. And I will see you very soon. Again, tap the like button if you're watching up until this point. Share this channel. If you like what you see, if you appreciate this daily uploads and daily reminders and daily content, share this channel like yeah like help it why not um do your part and i'll try to do mine every single day to, to help you in this crazy crypto world like crazy crazy crypto world it's non-stop 24 7 that is why we speak about it all the time and i it's literally changing so fast so fast so fast that is why I try to speak fast also to get a lot of information in. But again, if you appreciate this, share this channel with your family and friends. And I will see you all very soon. And yeah, take care. Until next time, Mr. Mufleh, out.